And we are back. That did not mean to happen, but fuck it. Anyway, we're back with more of the saga of Terry Funk. And uh, last time, first off, we had the match of the year. The triple threat cage match with Conor McGregor and CM Punk. Don't know how you won that one. I, well, because our good friend Cactus Jack decided to recreate his Hell in the Cell match. He <laughs> <laughs> totally did. He, he did a pantomime of the original Hell in the Cell match with The Undertaker. But, um... <laughs> oh, that was tremendous. And we also turned heel. Now, there's a part of me that's tempted to just kind of go into this match. Because my health is incredibly low. I think that's what we're going to do. Because it's a shoot fight. We pretty much get knocked down and we're going to lose. And actually, we need to lose uh, in order to uh, meet the requirements for Dana White. Because he said we've been winning too much. Oh, it's time to do the J-O-B on the PPV. Yeah, I just hope it's not going to cost me that dollar. Middle-aged weight champion. Oh, boy. I mean, Leon's a buddy of ours. Yeah, I don't think he's gonna be in much of an issue. After you were screaming, kids can be quiet for one second, I've got something to say. I used to pander to you morons, but I'm not interested in winning a popularity contest anymore, you egg sucking dogs. Whether it's the marks in the arena or the puppets backstage, I don't care if anybody likes me or not. From now on, my only priority is to succeed at any cost, and nobody is going to stand in my way. He sure looks like a man who should never go near a scarecrow. <laughs> 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 the rest like, oh, I'm out of here. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Match of the year. Match of match the year. Of the year. <laughs> <laughs> A three second match. Your promo lasted about ten times as long. I beat myself. <laughs> the jumping clothesline because I didn't land it knocked me down, and that got him the win because it was a shoot fight. That's like the old N64 game. Just hold the analog stick to take the pin. <laughs> oh. Well, we got the loss requirement. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I, I got to highlight that. That's got to go on uh, there. You got to make that a short. That was amazing. Yeah. <laughs> oh, welcome to the video, everybody. <laughs> oh, my knees. <laughs> Big heel turn. Lose immediately. In three seconds. Uh, congratulations to Leon Locke for becoming the new middleweight champion of Weekend Warriors. Terry Funk's status has dropped after losing the middleweight championship in that match. Now how much are we going to get paid for this work is the real question. Uh, by the way, I like how in a shoot promotion we got told we got to lose. Yeah, right? <laughs> Alright, I'd say. Ooh. Still, pretty good pay for three seconds work. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. I was sorry to see you lose the middleweight title, Terry, but I hope you can win it back. Okay, thank hope you. Hope you win it back. Man. This heel turns I, off to a rocky start. I was not ready for this. <laughs> no. <laughs> Ken Shamrock's attitude has deteriorated considerably in recent weeks. Ryback has been released by Weekend Warriors and must now make ends meet on the independent circuit. What is he, what is he doing with his finger? His Don't fingers. know. Oh, God. Wrestling School have crowned Bushwhacker Luke as their new undergraduate champion. <laughs> okay. Viscera has left wrestling school to pursue a career at Weekend Warriors. Ah, oh, shit. Somebody get the Viagra. God damn. Brian Knobs has left wrestling <laughs> school to pursue a career at Rising Sun Pura Resi. <laughs> oh, God. Terry Funk has been challenged to put someone over by the fourth week of July. I think we did. I'm pretty sure we accomplished that. An online poll has identified Mark Henry as the strongest wrestler in the world. 
Congratulations, Terry Funk. You followed my advice and made your prospects better than ever. Yeah, we lost the championship and four popularity points. Go on. Please accept the $1,000 bonus as a reward. Just make sure you keep up the good work. You bitch. I'm looking forward to when you're leaving and you just flatten that baldy. Yeah. What's wrong? Ooh. How you doing, Dr. Death? God. You know, he's making a... Uh, no, he's making a hundred grand plus per week. Oh. A, a shovel. Oh, God. Triple H is here to bury someone. Hi. Whoa. Jeez. Okay. I guess we're not answering the phone. Terry, you almost figured out how to how to answer the phone there. Good job, bud. Phones are complicated. We've taken each other hell and back, Funk, and I've had enough of it. Hi, Minoru Suzuki. Why don't we bury the hatchet so that we can get both back on concentrating on our careers? We're a heel. You totally have to say no. <sighs> I ain't through with you yet. <laughs> <laughs> Cartwheels out of the way, Jesus. Ah, shit, I'm about to lose this fight, too. Oh, you're fine. Maybe oh. <laughs> for the ring, we face each other in like an hour. We go backstage live right now. Oh, God, Jerry, fuck! I'm gonna get you, you son of a bitch! <laughs> hey, didn't we get you fired, Swagger? Pretty sure. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's good. Hey! Wait a minute! Oh, God! Uh-oh. Pretty cool. He's not happy with you. No, no, I want to see. Fuck you! God, he just lumberjacked everywhere. Hey, man, can we stop drinking and help us here? Jeez. Oh, oh God. God! Right in the corner of the desk. My eyes! My eyes! Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Apparently, Terry's a little pissed off about losing his title. Apparently. Mick just ran off to the press room. Good for me. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, God. Wait. Three. Two. One. So long! Until we meet again! <laughs> Hopefully it's not a, a shoot fight. It's not. It's just a hardcore match. Yeah! Who are we facing? Oh, Minoru Suzuki. What a surprise. I had no idea. That's right, he did say we were facing Yes. Yes, he did. Those oh my god. Those actually read will be aware of my contract the Weekend Warriors expires soon. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. If Dana White doesn't give me the respect I deserve and beg me to stay, this might very well be my last match. You should injure him and end his career for Dana. Of course, if that happens, it'll be your loss because I'm the best thing on this show. Oh, yeah? You smell pretty. I was gonna say, Terry fucking sniffing his hair. You smell. You smell pretty. Oh wow, I use an hour. <laughs> Terry's like, that's my word, I'll kill you. I'm gonna kill you, you son of a bitch. Hey, you know? Go! Three! <laughs> <laughs> this heel turn has been a great thing. Two matches, 15 combined seconds. Get back here! Get your heat back. Who's this guy flexing in the crowd?
Oh God! Die! That would be that would be his last. Wait, why is Nick in the crowd? I don't know. <laughs> is he dead yet? No. Oliver ever on the tombstone? Yeah. Does that, I was gonna say, does that make it a tombstone? I was gonna right? say the same damn thing. <laughs> hey, I will land this on you. Ah! Oh, oh Jesus God. Christ! I think now you're getting somewhere. Proved considerably that winning so convincingly, Terry Funk's profile has suffered. Our ratings went down. Winoru Suzuki confirmed not a draw. Exactly. 15 seconds to do it. I don't know, maybe you should go sleep at the hospital and get back on track. I guess. Fucking Kali. That didn't help, but you were already kind of in trouble at that point. Hi, <laughs> Dr. Dave. Dave. Man, there's finally some cops on the street. That's good. Yeah, I see that. God. Uh oh. Oh no! Is this the end of Terry Funk? Hi, so Jim Duggan has left All American Wrestling to pursue a career in Federation Online. Terry Funk was found unconscious in the street and will be resting up in a hospital for the next one week. That was just speedrunning. You got there quicker. We're wrong. No, we're not. Just go to sleep. I'm gonna sleep. I'm going to do it in a bed. Doesn't look like a bed. Uh oh. Maybe try not losing it the first 15 seconds. What just happened? Nice. Well, it would have been higher if you didn't make us lose. I think the bed got trashed. Yes, it did. Kamala. Just just let a man rest on a bed, people. Oh, no. The hell is going on in this cartoon? I have no idea. <laughs> You're gonna let me sleep, right, Kamala? Okay. Maybe just standing guard. Okay. Nice. Uh, it's getting paid to be in the hospital. Maple Leaf Graphics. Maple Leaf Grappling's profile has risen after going with a retro developer for their 2023 video game, which has since been downloaded millions of times. Matt Riddle's strength has deteriorated considerably in recent weeks. You don't exactly strike me as a powerhouse. The Great Khali's feud with Terry Funk appears to have lost momentum and is no longer over with the fans. I didn't know it was over with the fans at all. Terry Funk has recovered from his injury and looks forward to getting back in the ring. Terry Funk has been challenged to increase his win rate to 69% by the third week of August. You basically have three weeks and you gotta win all three. Weekend Warriors proposed TV <laughs> taping on the third week of August has been cancelled. You've gotta go rustle up some business. <laughs> I have a handicap match. We're not rolling Versus, for that. No. Oh, Ooh. Wait a you get Dr. Dan. I have the handicap. Let's go. Yes, absolutely. 
You're a Although, Doctor Death, how dare you turn up to face me in this state? Doctor Death, by the way, looks really messed up. You expect me to take it easy on you? You leave me no choice but to make an example of you. Please let me win my belt back. Let's see if we can get some Dr. Death help on the screen here. Dr. Death's in bad shape. Ah! Out of nowhere! By God! God, God damn, all my stuff! Just a full drop kick into the into the wire. Good God! All right, Terry's a stri uh, striker. I forgot about this. Yes, the best striker in the business today. I love all the feedback on the microphone. Let's have, let's, uh, what the fuck? <laughs> Thank you, Doctor Death. You really helped. <laughs> he, he fanned the air a little around you there to get you revived. Jesus. Dr. Death, you bastard. Try to snake the pin. One. Two. Really? Oh, we're holding on. <laughs> Dr. Death, just kick him while he's down. Thanks, Doc. He actually helped! One... Two... Two! Come on, Leon. Jesus! One... Two... Love the disrespectful pin. That encounter established Leon Locke as a heel who is despised by the fans. What? <laughs> How? How? What is what? What? Everybody's a heel. <laughs> Terry Funk's profile has improved considerably by winning at a major event. Dr. Death Steve Williams' profile has improved as being on the winning team in that match. So to recap, you lost in three seconds as a heel. You lost in 12 seconds as a heel. You went in two and a half as a heel, and now the other guy is more of a heel than you. Yes. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to make sure I had that clear. Hey, you broke 30 grand. Cactus Jack's strength has deteriorated considerably in recent weeks. Terry Funk has been challenged to increase his win rate by 69% by the third week of August. And yeah, we have a, a missing week in there, too. Yeah, we are in a new month. Um, that felt incredibly short. You good to keep this going, or you want to save yeah. it for the next video? Yeah. Going. Uh, we got to see if we, we can save your job for the second time. Okay, well, we're fighting a shoot fight. <laughs> Proceed. Uh, you sure you don't want to roam? <laughs> you, do you want to keep your job? Fine. <laughs> oh no, not the racist tribal music. Oh god. And he's got Mr. Fuji as a manager. Who is walking the ramp? <laughs> Jeff Hardy, eat your heart out. Alright, Umaga, please fall and die. You gonna climb the case there, bud? God, he almost did too. <laughs> he, he was playing with fate there. Yeah, yeah I'm a heel. I'm a heel. I'm gonna wave to you. Um, Fuji, what are you doing? Oh God, not a good start. <laughs> Break his fucking ankle. Of all the places to try to break Umaga, I think legs might be the hardest. I was gonna say, he did have fucking tree trim. He had fucking tree trunks for legs. 
Absolutely. Samoan through and through. Jesus, man. And you're bloody. I'm surprised with the amount of pile drivers you've done, you haven't straight up injured someone in the ring yet. I know. I'm disappointed in that fact. <laughs> oh, 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 that might have fixed it. That might have fixed it. You went from half to nothing. Oh my god. Holy shit, into the weak spot of Mongo is his spine. There we go. Oh, God. Terry Funk's profile has proved considerably after winning so convincingly in that match. Umaga's profile, or Umanga's profile has suffered considerably after being defeated so easily in that match. So, you've now been in the ring for four matches and it's been less than four minutes combined. Yes. Win, <laughs> lose, or draw. <laughs> Ah, we are now in third place in the ratings. Damn. You know, I'm surprised no one has made us an offer yet to join another promotion. Christian has left Federation Online to pursue a career at Super Lucha Libre. Conor McGregor has developed a heated rivalry with Mike Tyson in Hollywood. Oh, God. <laughs> That's... Seems like a recipe for all the disaster. The Great Khali's attitude has improved considerably in recent weeks. Probably got a great him. attitude. Holy crap. Hollywood have poached Yokozuna from Rising Sun Prioresu in a deal estimated to be worth $4,800 per appearance. Pretty nice. Terry Funk has been challenged to increase his win rate by 69% by the week of the third week of August. You need to the 5%. You've won twice. Oh, congratulations, Terry Funk. You followed my advice yeah. and made your prospects better than ever. Here's an extra $1,000. Sweet. Thank you. Now I don't have to. We have a shoot fight with the great colleague. You know you want to roam and screw this up. Come on. We're roaming. <laughs> Hi. Bye. My good friend. Whose name is eluding me. Oh, hi, Brock. Alright. Is there anybody on my list? <laughs> of people who ought to be killed. Hi, Minoru Suzuki. You're in good health. <laughs> I'm not fucking with you. Yeah. Oh. Got it. I'm just gonna steal your title. Ah. I thought you were giving it back to him. Nope. <laughs> Someone's playing a guitar. Shinsuke Nakamura. Oh, it's the hockey talk, man. Of course it is. Jeff Hardy. Jamerson. Kenny Omega. You know, you keep walking toward me, and I don't like that. God, three more hours to you before your match. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Hit and run. Yep. Uh, um, what the hell happened over there? CM Punk apparently was drunk. CM drunk. Hi, Mark Merrill. See, I'm drunk? Wow. I Maybe we can work with this. You know, I would appreciate it if you did not walk up to me like that. It's very rude. Very rude. Did I say it was very rude? It's very rude. Hi, Dan Severn. That's right, you walk away. You little bitch. Hey! I'm watching you. It's my belt now. It's my belt, huh? Look at that. Coming down with your your championship belt. <laughs> Which ah, they made me give it back. Ah, uh, too bad. More racist theme music. 
Time for the Punjabi prison match. You that wasn't a real match they did, bro, right? You're not even a wrestler at all. What you say? Really, bitch? really great, Kali. What's that up in your glass castle? You're a glorified stuntman who can only win matches by swinging weapons and smashing through furniture. Yeah, when I step into this ring, it becomes a war zone. I guess that's too much for you to handle. This match is too much for you to handle because you're not civilized enough to play by my rules. Great Don't get sucked in. Technician. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! What the hell? I didn't get it in the frame clipping. He just club you? He headbutted me. Oh, God. Yeah! Break his back and make him humble. Great camera. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Jeez. Break his fucking arm. I like how you've gone from power drive champion to striker to now. Submission technician. Oh god! <laughs> Holy shit! Whatever works. Because you see, just when you thought of all the answers, I go and change the question. God damn it. <laughs> oh god. He's slowly spinning in a circle. Let go of my arm! Let go! You don't look like what you're at the top. Hey, Kali, I want to ask you a few questions, dog. Let me interview you, you son of a bitch. I heard that's so bad. That's so bad. There you go. I think he's dead now. He might be. Terry Funk's progress is being hindered by the limitations of Weekend Warriors. The Great Kali injured his rib in that match and will be out of action for the next four weeks. Let's go. We'll visit yeah. him in the hospital. <laughs> Mr. Fuji oh, is disappointed that his client lost that match. Is this how you committed so many murders of Scott Steiner? Yes. Oh, no. Well, that and my strength was almost maxed out. That would also do it. So you just keep hitting the screwdriver out in the middle of the street and, you know, they would just die. <laughs> Thanks for getting rid of that great Kali. It's about time somebody took out the trash. Thanks, Dr. Death. Thank you, Dr. Death. I see a wild Bobby Lashley. Nah, you're in good help. I'm not gonna fuck with you. Hey, Lee. He's dead, though. Who was dead? Jay Lethal. Yeah, but he's our friend. I know. Kinda. Frenemies. Yeah, um, the hospital's this way. No, that's where the hospital was. No, no, no. no. Right down by that uh, wheelchair. Okay. Okay, I believe you. Well, that's good. Because I'm right, goddammit. <laughs> How you doing? Hey. I'm scarred for life because of you. Now I won't rest until you share my pain. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Fuck that, it's not my problem. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Excuse me, only murdered great Kali. Oh, yes. <laughs> Thank 
Fuck you, doctor! <laughs> oh god. I, I can go to sleep. I think the doctor said he was gonna kill it for you. Oh. One more for the road. One more. One more. Oh, wait a minute! Oh! oh. Fuji! Oh god! The doc jumped in. He tried to send me to the cemetery. He did. You saw that, right? Yeah, I totally saw that. Fuji, you're next. I'm taking a nap, but then Fuji's gonna die. <laughs> He, you heard that? He tried to attack me. I saw it. Dan the Beast Sever has developed a friendship with Matt Bloom of Wrestling School. Minoru Suzuki's feud with Terry Funk appears to have lost momentum and is no longer over with the fans. The Great Collie was found dead! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> we at, least his, at least his skill and agility went up. <laughs> The Great Kali was found dead in the hospital this morning. Police are appealing for any information about the 34-year-old's death. God damn. Wade Barrett's, uh, Wade Barrett's agility has deteriorated considerably in recent weeks. After eight hours of comfortable sleep, Terry Funk's energy levels are now 100%. Nothing to make you sleep like killing a man on a hospital floor. I had a beautiful dream last night. Paul Capallo and Jake Hager have defeated Shank and Nails to become the new group project champions of wrestling school. The industry will come together this week to stage a special tribute in memory of the great Kali. Prior to the public show, a private funeral will take place in the cemetery at 3 p.m. An online poll has identified Kurt Angle as the best overall wrestler in the world. Damn, that's there, Kurt. Well, we got a <clears> shoot <throat> fight with Kerry Von Erich, but we're going to roam. Oh, God. This is going to be a marathon. Be keeping an eye on your progress. I think some changes need to be made. What, not committing as many murders? You're not fit enough to give the fans their money's worth. They pay to see athletes go the distance. Well, he's got you there. <laughs> You've got until the third week of September to get your stamina up to 81% or I'll throw in the towel. What is your stamina now? Because you better start running your laps. I don't know, but I'm going to... We're going to the cemetery. Would you like this water bottle, Terry Funk? It seems you need it more than I do. You know what? Sure. You're welcome to it, Terry. That's what friends are for. Okay, through the wall. Okay. Let's go to the cemetery. It's just too bad we haven't been able to get on uh, Conrad and Thompson's show yet to talk about how much we really enjoyed seeing the life fade out of the great Kali's eyes. I, I mean... That's what I thought, too. But. Okay, the funeral starting. That's the airport. Can you get to it from the air? Cemetery, here we go. Uh. Thanks for attending the funeral, Terry. The great colleague would be happy to see this turn out. <laughs> Before anybody says anything in public for tonight's show, we thought it might be more appropriate to gather here. Gather here? The great colleague would have wanted the show to go on, and he would have also wanted your lives to go on. Probably would have wanted his own life to go on, The too. great colleague can never take another step in this world, so we must appreciate the time we have. Just for one day, let's put aside fighting and respect each other as fellow warriors. Yeah, about that. <laughs> Is, he, is that Brock from Pokemon behind him? Uh, that is Nacho Libre. <laughs> hi, hi everybody. Widow. Test, Steve Blackman. All right. Is that a fire extinguisher? It sure looks like one, doesn't it? Oh no, Sergeant Slaughter's here. He's got dynamite, doesn't he? Talk to him. You need dynamite. He does. Talk to him. Hey, Sarge, you want to offer me some dynamite, bud? We're, we're friends. Hi. I guess not. You can't just start a conversation. They got to kind of start one with you. All right, funeral's over. Back to the hospital. Let's use dying. 
That was very respect respectful of you. Uh, what is going on in that bed? Jesus! Uh, Ken? Ken, are you okay? I prayed for you. Uh, what? What? What is going on here? <laughs> what the f Connor, stop! You're drunk! Butterbean and Connor McGregor are about to fight. This just screams bad news. A lot was going on there, and somehow you caused none of it. I know. Who is this level-headed Terry Funk? He's the heel. Ah, I see. He's biding his time. Oh, we gotta go to a press conference. I guess. I'm bringing this fire extinguisher. Because I'm already the life extinguisher. Now let's see if we uh, changed all the questions. Let's see. Welcome to the international press conference for Maple Leaf Grappling vs. Weekend Warriors. Kerry Von Eric, what does Maple Leaf Grappling bring to this fight against Weekend Warriors? Please. Please don't. I'm so much more agile than Terry Funk will feel like he's being double teamed. Okay. Oh. Terry Funk, you just heard what Kerry Von Eric just said. How do you respond to that? I'm so agile. Everybody knows the fans are behind me, so they'll be the adrenaline in my veins. Heal, you know, everybody. Yeah, heal, Terry Funk. This has the potential to be the best match on the card. So buy your ticket to see it live. It is a shoot fight, right? It is. Nice. And it's we match need to go time. now. You're curtain jerking. Oh, they're gonna charge me for bringing this fire extinguisher out, but oh well. Data might back you up. Yeah. Who's Carrie bringing with? Jim Cornette. Corny! Back in my day, we had the Midnight Express, the Rock and Roll Express, and the Panda Express, and nobody complained. Fuck that Kenny Omega. This show is dedicated to the memory of the great Kali who recently passed away. The great Kali's work in this ring meant a lot to fans, but the person he was backstage meant even more to us. Says his killer. <laughs> he lived for his family, and through them he lives on. We hope the donations from the show bring them comfort. But that's I enough talking. The great Kali is sitting up there waiting for a show. Let's give him one. All right. Send, send, send the fans uh, to the concession stand. Oh, what? Happy. That started poorly. God damn it. Have a better start there, Terry. Yeah. The Samoan submission machine, Terry Funk. <laughs> oh! Oh, on the bell! And the ref has lost all control of this match. Oh, Jesus! Oh. <laughs> Ring the damn bell! Uh oh. Uh oh. He's mad now. Stop a mud hole in him. Rolls out for some, some break. Watch out. Live mic. Uh, your mind ref? What kind of is it? A rope break and a shoe flank. Come on. Ding, ding, ding. Let's go. Phew. No, it's not. Somehow not done with that. Oh. 
So fun fact, if it's not in the ring, it doesn't count. <laughs> Let's go! Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> and the best thing is that Maple Leaf is the one ahead of you, so you doing that is, is good. Yeah. Kerry Von Erich has damaged the reputation of Maple Leaf grappling by failing to win that interpromotional contest. Terry Funk has raised the profile of Weekend Warriors by winning that interpromotional Yeah, contest. so your popularity went up. It's up to 90 now. Jim Cornette is disappointed that his client lost that match. Fuck you, motherfucker! I don't know why it sounded like Shorzy there, but... <laughs> Dana White is happy that his client won that match. Although it is Maple Leaf grappling, so I guess that does make sense. Yeah. Fuck you, Shorzy! Oh, man, they took a huge dive. Yeah, they did. Oh, man, cool. Federation Online dove, too. Oh, shit. All-American Wrestling is now hot. Listen, Terry Funk, I've got a match coming up that I'm not sure I can win on my own. Oh. Would you consider assisting me oh. at ringside? $5,600 in it for you if you do. Oh, you bet your sweet ass. And you know what the best part is? What's I don't that? have to do anything, because I can control him. Oh, nice. Thanks for doing this, Terry. I can't lose with you by my side. Oh, shit. Magnum TA with Jim Cornette. No, hear me out. We could just beat the shit out of Jim Cornette for no reason. We could. That's it. Just get your money. Goldberg! This, yeah. this oh, is I don't think I can win without you, Terry. My nine, my nine policemen didn't show up. Hey, we'll get to see you do some different moves. That'll be fun. Or strike. Or strike. Goldberg is in a bit of a tough spot health-wise. Oh my god. We're basically looking at the 90s version of Magnum TA versus the 80s version of Goldberg. And tell me I'm wrong. I don't feel like you're wrong, actually. <laughs> oh god damn. Really? Wow! Into a sleeper, what a reverse! Oh, excuse you! Uh, okay, what? I'm sorry, how did Magnum not go down off that? Dude! What is selling? Uh, what is Cornette doing? Did you see that? Cornet drank the table oh. halfway around the freaking ring. Oh, the tennis racket. That's the finish. One, two, three. Let's go. Yeah. Is that Todd Jerry Sags? That was, that was uh, Brian Knobs. Or Knobs, sorry, wrong one. Goldberg has raised the profile of Weekend Warriors by winning that interpromotional contest. Magnum T has you damaged were... the reputation of Maple Leaf Grappling by failing to win that interpromotional contest. You have single handedly destroyed Maple Leaf Grappling tonight. I love it. You're up to 92 now as a Fed. Because your popularity hit 92. Hi, Cornette. Actually, I'm not going to fuck with him just in case he gives me a potential contract. That's fair. I had to go Great mood, huh? 
She was hanging out in her hotel room. I love the fire extinguisher is now your 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 uh gym rat, your ring rat. There we it's, go. It's my bedside manner. Yeah. <laughs> this has been a hell of a marathon one, but uh you, you really had to do all that hard work there. I did. Mark Merrill has defeated Brock Lesnar wow. to become the new heavyweight champion. And he, and, he, and he reclaimed his wife. Good yeah. for him. <laughs> Dan the B7 has formed a new team with Matt Riddle. Oh, God. Jesus. After 10 hours of comfortable sleep, Terry Funk's energy levels are now 100%. Newbie Nate has left wrestling school to pursue a career at Federation Online. Robert Rue has left wrestling school to pursue a career at Maple Leaf Grappling. Terry Funk has been challenged to increase his stamina to 81% by the third week of September. And you lost some of that match. We have a sumo contest with Mark Henry. Oh, good God. We're just proceeding. Just going to do a marathon one this time. Yeah. Welcome to this press conference as we look ahead to Terry Funk versus Mark Henry. Terry Funk, after beating Mark Henry last time, how will you ensure history repeats itself? It's a long after, As the fitter athlete, I don't even have to beat Mark Henry. I just have to let him beat himself. Oh. Um. Mark Henry, you heard what Terry Funk just said. How do you respond to that? I'm going to fucking hear your Terry old woman. Funk doesn't have the right attitude for this business, but I'll teach him a lesson. I mean, Mark Henry showed he had a hell of an attitude for this because he tried he to get him to quit how many times? Yeah. All right. Let's get to the match. Now, thankfully, I kind of mentioned this before, but we have an overhead belly to back suplex. We are about to spam the shit out of that move. All week, we've been polling fans to see on which match they would like to see, and they voted for. Terry Funk versus Mark Henry in a ropeless sumo contest. I've never seen this match type before on this. Which, conveniently enough, is the exact situation we were prepared for. Thank God. Gotta love wrestling. In also, why, you, why, is he wearing, why is he wearing a cross of Big Boss Bat and the Shields outfit? I, I don't know. <laughs> Wrestlers thrown out of the ring will be eliminated. The contest must stay inside the ring where weapons are illegal. Oh, those rules suit me perfectly. Seems as fans want to see you suffer. Oh, yeah? No, they just felt like they had to do something this drastic to make one, uh, one of your matches entertaining. Really? I'm the, I guess I'm not strong enough. Crap. Now what are you going to do? Try again. <laughs> yeah! Uh oh, who's coming out? I'm that one. You want to start some shit? <laughs> Terry Funk's oh God. is being hindered by the limitations of Weekend Warriors. Mark Henry's profile has suffered considerably after incurring a loss at a major event. Matt Riddle has been accused of going into the business for himself by interfering in that match. By the way, the popularity went down 2%. Oh, our ratings went down. Federation yeah. Online went back up. All right. Yeah. All right. Uh-oh. I may be the heavyweight champion, but we're all responsible for Weekend Warrior success. Thank you. Very nice of you. Rising Sun Pro Wrestling have become significantly more popular in recent weeks with rating up to 84%. Dr. Death Steve Williams' skills have deteriorated considerably in recent weeks. Terry Funk has been challenged to increase his stamina to 81% by the third week of September. It run I've missed working with you now that you're at Weekend Warriors and I'm at wrestling school. Because I got you fired. Do you think there's a spot for me at Weekend Warriors on the same terms? Yeah, fuck it. Welcome back. Thanks for making this happen, Terry. I can't wait to work with you again. Let's try to get him fired again. 
All right. We are now in September. Holy crap. Where we have to get our stamina up to 81%. And I'm going to show you how to do that next time. Because there's actually a way. It's not that hard. Um, Laps in the gym. But we'll see more about that next time. Until then, take care.